Hello friends subscribe to our channel GDC and press the bell icon for more updates. Now, different drug act in GABA A receptor. In this GABA A receptor, various drug act at different location. So which drug act at which location and what is the mode of action of that drug, I will discuss here. First drug here is GABA. As we have discussed, GABA. So, ga so GABA, where GABA will divide? GABA increases chloride and conductance by the increasing duration, opening duration. Opening duration. Chloride and conductance means opening duration by binding at GABA side. Means GABA bind at GABA side and that will lead increase chloride and conductance that is duration of opening increases. Remember two things, there is two types of work. Duration increasing and the frequency increasing. When any drug increases the duration, that will means time. And when we use the frequency, that means the number of opening of channel will be increases, not the duration. So this is the main difference. First drug here is GABA. Second drug is benzodiazepine. So what will happen? Benzodiazepine means shortly we can write it BZD benzodiazepine benzodiazepine increases frequency of chloride ion channel opening and where it will bind? it will bind in the benzodiazepine binding site that is present in the alpha gamma sub interface your next drug is Barbiturate. So, what will cause the barbiturate? Barbiturate increases duration of chloride ion channel opening. This is the main difference. Barbiturate increases duration of chloride and channel while benzodiazepine increases the frequency of channel opening. There is a question asked that which of the following means benzodiazepine in barbiturate which is the GABA myotic action. That means barbiturate can increase or the duration of channel opening as well as it can directly stimulate the channel opening. Why? Benzodiazepine cannot open the channel. It only increases the frequency of channel opening. That is the main difference. Your next drug is Bicuculin. And where Bicuculin will bind? Bicuculin is the competitive antagonist of GABA receptor. Competitive antagonist of GABA receptor. Your next drug is beta carbolin. Beta carbolin. Remember one point. Beta carbolin is an inverse agonist. We have, we know very well, there is four words, agonist, antagonist, partial agonist and inverse agonist. So, beta carbolin is an inverse agonist. Inverse agonist of GABA receptor. Then your next drug is picrotoxin. So, where will be picrotoxin at? Remember one point. GABA bind at beta subunit, barbiturate bind at alpha beta subunit, benzodiazepine bind at alpha GABA interface. Means these channels can regulate the GABA receptor 
from the above view. But picrotoxin is a drug which directly inhibit or close the channel by the inhibiting from the inside. That is picrotoxin is the block chloride ion channel non-competitively means picrotoxin block chloride ion channel non-competitively your next term is flumazenil Flumazenil is an antagonist of benzodiazepine. Antagonist of benzodiazepine. That is, flumazenil is also called as antidote of benzodiazepine. And there is one more point. There is a question why benzodiazepine is more preferred than? Barbiturate. There is a first answer of this question that bar benzodiazepine increases the frequency by which the toxicity will be low, while barbiturate increases the duration that means toxicity will be high. First point. Second point, benzodiazepine have an antidote that is flumazenil, while barbiturate do not have any antidote. That's why benzodiazepine is more preferred than barbiturate.